So, uh, Jaron, obviously this is a big two points for you heading into this afternoon's game. Describe uh, how it went for you uh, against the depleted Sudbury lineup. Oh, well, they're a great team, but uh, we knew before the game we had to take advantage of their uh, short lineup. They have a few good players out there, so uh, it was great to get the win, and it's uh, good going in the playoffs for us. You headed into uh, today's game minus Joey Miller and Nathan Hebear, two key guys on your team. What went right for you out there against uh, picking up a big two points tonight? Uh, well, those guys are obviously uh, pretty key to our team, too. Um, you know, they they add some depth to our team, and uh, without them, it's uh, you know, it makes it a little bit more tougher, but it also uh, makes us uh, know that we have to step up uh, that much more. You must be proud with the way how your season is going this year. After putting up 11 goals uh, last season, then you find yourself just three ahead of the 30 goal plateau. So describe uh, how this season has really turned around for you in your sophomore season. Yeah, well, uh, obviously, I came in the season. Um, kind of looking for more of a leadership role. I uh, came in with a lot more confidence, and uh, I think it's really helped me uh, over the course of the season, getting better as a player, and uh, really happy so far. How did it feel getting your second uh, four-point game of the season? Uh, it's uh, pretty good, but uh, more importantly, the win's uh, even better. Heading out on the road now, what's your goal? I uh, just got to get uh, some, more, uh, some more wins, right? Uh, I got to end off the season uh, with uh, those last few wins, ended off strong, and uh, we'll be good to go. Thank you very much, Jaron. All right, thanks a lot.